one of the, the fights that we were in, and again, it was the Battle of Hit, actually, we were on railroad tracks. And uh, one of the M40A3s carried by one of my snipers, who I will I'll make fun of later, the, he, uh, he left his M40A3 on the railroad track. We, we were in the middle of a firefight and a train came. Uh, and, and we had to, we had to get, get out of town quickly. Now, he had been using that sniper rifle. He had also been using a light machine gun. Um, he grabbed the light machine gun and ran, not realizing that the back end of the sniper rifle was actually on the rails. Um, he assumed, obviously, someone else was going to grab it. These things kind of things happen when you're in a fight and a train suddenly decides to roll through your position. Uh, we really didn't think that the Iraqi train system was still robust enough to be rolling, but it was at that point. The train hit the M40A3, um, knocked, spun it over, knocked it down, um, and while no one really wanted to tell me because I was in charge and I didn't know about it at the time, from what I am told, uh, the first question was, well, I wonder if it's still shoots, it still has a zero. It wasn't visibly broken, but it got basically hit by the train and spun around and spun off into the side. So they wanted to apply it. So the first thing they had to get behind the gun, they put it around it and they, they, they check it out. And, and it, it retained its zero. Um, it was used throughout the rest of the deployment. Um, nobody wanted to tell me until after I had retired that that had happened because I probably would have been a bit upset with one of the key elements, especially of a force reconnaissance unit, is that you always have your hand on your weapon and you always know where it is and you know, never leave a weapon lying about, especially in a combat situation. But I understand now that that's what happened. And, and, but the gun, the gun survived and the gun built by the Precision Weapons uh, Shop at, at Quantico, but using our fire control and our action, uh, no problems. It's probably still in an armory somewhere performing its job.